Hello there, I'm Ryan and welcome back to Four Home Bartenders. If you have a recipe that you would like to see featured on this channel, then please check out the link in the description box below. Now today I have another Star Wars inspired drink for you. Last week we played around a bit in the light side of the force. Today we're heading towards the dark side with the Dark Lord Saber. Alright, let's talk about the ingredients. You're going to want a Blanco Tequila, I like to use Olmeca Altos, a Mezcal, today I am using Gracias a Dios in Mezcal, Lime Juice, Aperol, Grenadine, and Tahine. Alright, let's get to building. Now I did forget to mention that this is going to be served in a highball glass, go ahead and get one ready for yourself. Alright, here we go. Now I like to start with my syrups whenever possible. So into our shaker tin we're going to add a half ounce of grenadine, followed up with a half ounce of lime juice, three quarters of an ounce of Aperol, And then one ounce each of our tequila and mezcal. So here we go. One ounce of tequila. And one ounce of mezcal. And then to that we're going to add a dash of tahini. All right, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab some crushed ice and just put a tiny little bit of crushed ice on in there, like so. And we're going to whip shake until all of the ice, or at least most of the ice, has completely melted. All right, here we go. All right, now into our highball glass, we're going to add crushed ice about halfway up. Now we're going to open pour right on in. And then top it off with some more brushed ice. And we stick in our straw. And there we have it. Dark Lord Saber. As you can tell, we got this beautiful red color as we should have with all of our dark side drinks. And when you serve it in a highball glass like this, it very much reminds us of a red lightsaber. All right, let's go ahead and take a sip. Mmm. Oh yeah. I really, really like this one. You've got a little bit of smoke from the Mezcal, a little bit of bitterness from the Aperol, a little bit of sweetness from the grenadine, a little bit of spiciness from the tahini. The lime juice balances it all out, and overall, this is just a fantastic drink. It is intense refreshment after a long day of hunting down rebels, force choking insubordinates, and ruling the galaxy with an iron fist. Cheers! Cheers.